over 800 textile dyeing units in Tirupur are an important component in the entire chain in the manufacture of garments. Tirupur, also known as the knitwear capital and as Dollar City, contributes to 2.25 billion US dollars and employs over 600,000 people in the textile industry. The discharge of untreated wastewater from the dyeing units into the river Noyal led to the gradual degradation of the river and polluted the groundwater as well. The local farmers petitioned the courts against the pollution caused by the industry, which ordered the industry to implement zero liquid discharge systems or face closure in 2006. The ZLD project was implemented by Tamil Nadu Water Investment Company Limited TWIC at a cost of 4,210 million rupees for a combined capacity of 53 MLD for nine common effluent treatment plants catering to about 244 dyeing units in the industrial town of Tirupur. Faced with the challenge and lack of technology and experience in ZLD worldwide, the project implementation ran into severe problems, particularly with thermal evaporation of reverse osmosis reject brine, leading to closure of all the dyeing units in Tirupur under the court orders in 2011. Faced with this daunting task under adverse circumstances of court closure and lack of faith on viability of technology for zero liquid discharge, TWIC, in close cooperation with the industry and support of the state government, developed and implemented a unique treated brine reuse technology at an additional cost of 1,500 million rupees for reuse of over 90% of the sodium sulfate salt along with reuse of 98% of recovered water by a cluster of dyeing units connected to a central wastewater treatment facility. Underground sewer network for collection of wastewater, equalization tank, biological oxidation tanks, clarifier, tertiary filtration system comprising of quartz filters, decolorant resins filters and softener filters, reverse osmosis system, recovered water distribution system, Mechanical Vapor Recompression MVR Type Evaporators Brine Treatment System Multiple Effect Evaporator and Adiabatic Chiller Online Monitoring with SCADA This technology not only demonstrates high recovery of water, but also recovery of salts for reuse within the dyeing industry, thereby moving towards zero waste discharge and not just zero liquid discharge. The recovery of water and salt as liquid brine and globus salt makes it commercially viable and sustainable. Global Water Intelligence UK have recognized the Tirupur ZLD project implemented by TWIC for the prestigious Global Water Awards 2014 as highly commended under the Industrial Water Project of the Year category and has also termed it as a phoenix rising from the ashes of an environmental catastrophe. This ZLD project of TWIC has also been recognized by Water Reuse Association USA as a significant contributor to the community, choosing it as the Industrial Project of the Year 2014. The implementation of ZLD in the CETPs has resulted in stoppage of discharge of dying effluents into the river. The Noyal River and its dependents can now look up to a better future.